Hi, we're at the Canadian Victory Garden and we're uh, actually in the greenhouse and it's late March but uh, we've been quite successful with some of the plantings as we just showed but as guests we have Hank and Kathy so what do you think of the greenhouse? Uh, it's Amazing. great it's uh, it's nice to see that you guys uh, are, are working towards uh, showing you know up-and-coming people that want to get involved with uh, uh, agriculture or just growing their own food and more sustainable uh, what they can potentially do um, with a small plot of land. Yep, and you guys, you and Bob both have really long strips down off Give and Park, uh, Birch Creek, right? So long 300 foot lots. Yeah, I've got a, a 300 foot lot, uh, pretty similar to uh, Bob and uh, my mother, She's uh, she has a property up on Ritson and she's got uh, 660 feet. Uh, wow, so you guys have lots to plant. Any big things you're going to plant this year? Any? Any seed, going, seed, going through seed collections? Oh yeah, we've yeah. got uh, these, we've got tons. We've got uh, a lot of beets, uh, uh, turnips wow. um, uh, that we're getting ready to put in as soon as the grounds uh, we're able to work the grounds. Wow. Yeah. Uh, but we're gonna expand the beds. We're gonna do a lot of uh, uh, potatoes, uh, just about anything that uh, we yeah. consume in the house. We plan to, to grow on the property. It'd be a great expand. Uh, there's a, a woman who uh, King Solver. Have you read her book? No. She was off the grid uh, entirely fed their family from what they grew in their, I think it was North Carolina. It's a fascinating yeah. book to read, but I think this is great. So the there's a group of us, not a big group, but there's a group of us that have the same vision and, yeah. and ideas. So we'll exchange ideas and hopefully we'll have a competition. Perfect. Who, who has the, the best beets or potatoes, right? Yeah. That sounds good. And just to show down here, uh, wood chips from the Durham Woodworkers. And we've already got some plants here growing. Yeah, that's radishes, and then on this side is just lettuce. I just threw it down just for a lark, just to see what would happen, and, and lo and behold, it's grown. So now I'm going to take it. Now I'm all inspired. I'll come back. 